I'm James Warman. I'm a trend forecast from Futurologist. In this episode of Tech Design TV, we catch up with computers and work out if, in a world of convergence and multifunctionality, there's still room for a monofunctional device. I think the rise of tablet computers is really interesting. It was years ago that Bill Gates, the CEO of Microsoft, predicted that they'd be the next big thing. And although it didn't happen straight away, finally it's beginning to show signs of life. Things like Apple's iPad recently come out has attracted huge amounts of interest. There's still some practical problems to solve, but I think people are really keen on the idea of having something that they can carry with them where they can access the internet. Last year's game changer was definitely the netbook. This year, it's the touchscreen. Everyone's got a computer in their pocket these days with smartphones and obviously everyone's familiar with things like netbooks which are smaller laptops. Laptops are becoming more popular. It's all about portability, it's all about taking your computer wherever you want to go. Not surprising for a company that created the Ferrari netbook, design is at the heart of Acer's user-focused mission. Design is becoming uh, more and more important because the people, they're looking for technology with, with design which are expressed the technology. So very simple design, uh, simplicity is becoming uh, an important part as far as design is concerned because as far as technology is complexity. They're looking for something uh, which is uh, uh, recognizing them as unique. We know what technology can do, it has miniaturized uh, to, to a form factor that it, it becomes uh, kind of almost intangible or hard to deal with. So you've seen that the relationship how users interact with technology and the shape technology change is driven more by human needs, human interaction, and whenever human interaction with, between humans and technology uh, is, is, is coming around the corner, design is a very important factor. Acer has a product at every step of the digital cycle, including a new touchscreen smartphone based on the Android operating system. This is the, probably the best phone in the market in this moment in time. As the latest technology in terms of processor and in terms of uh, software, and this is a really big step ahead toward the convergence between uh, traditional uh, mobility IT products such as the laptops first uh, and the netbook which is already making a step ahead because uh, you know the netbook is more oriented to uh, content consumption than content creation which is the uh, main job of uh, uh, a notebook or a PC, a desktop PC, which is content creation. Already netbook is an application, an internet device. For us the main uh, um, claim for the netbook was uh, connecting anytime, anywhere because uh, you know you simply need to assess uh, certain application or certain uh, activity you normally be doing and 90% of your time you'll, you'll be doing so you don't need a big powerful machine like a notebook but you need battery life, you need instant on assess and you need to be able to assess to mails, to, to browse the internet and so on and so forth and then as a continuity of mobility you have a three and a half inch which is a PC. The big interesting thing is that the video consumption is becoming really very important and this is the best uh, HD video player uh, you have. Frog Design sees convergence as a key emerging trend. Whether all your music and your video and your TV is stored centrally in the cloud or if it's on a, on a box in my house, that doesn't really matter. I think the scenario is really that it's accessible from anywhere. And it's, it's ubiquitous available wherever I am. Although they strive for product connectivity, rather than believing in one ultimate device, Acer sees a place for complementary devices that address specific user needs. We are providing the customer with the right product and making sure that the, uh, the digital life is connected through the different products. We are uh, thinking to give to the customer the right product and, uh, what, and uh, connect it to the rest of their products, of their uh, needs, in order to have uh, you know, uh, the, the, the raw data and everything synchronized each other and having the right uh, form factor for the right moment. So where will the market be in five years? There's been a lot of talk about things like HUDs, which are head-up displays. So basically putting the information sort of over your eyes, maybe like retinal implants, all these cool sci-fi things. I think, if we're being honest, we're a long way from there quite yet. Do I think it's going to happen in the next decade? I think probably not. Will it happen soon? Possibly. The future of Acer is not in the product, but it's in the customer. So it's, it's giving the customer a seamless experience into the online community overall and uh, into the technology you can, you can find it right now. 
and uh, we are providing the customer with the right product and making sure that the uh, the digital life is connected through the different products.